Okay, here I'm is. We had supper. Oh, for another Hello Fresh. I cooked it. It took me an hour and a half, and it wasn't what it's supposed to be until Sharon came home and helped me finish or redo, uh, like the cold uh, zucchini that I had. Oh, I didn't know that I had to put it in the oven again, so she did. And uh, I had to redo the chicken because it kept coming out no good uh, to uh, was, it wasn't cooked, let's put it that way. It wasn't cooked. So I put it in again, and it wasn't cooked again. So I put it in again, and it was too late for that. So I fried it, and put it in the oven. Uh, not in the oven. I put it on a burner on top and uh, cooked it with some wet stuff and kind of kept it going. And it was delicious. The potatoes were mashed with some lumps because the lumper that I, or the, I should say the de-lumper that I have is eh, not the best de-lumper in the world. So... Alright, so I want to do this pan. Let's see what it looks like. Oh! See that? I'm going to put this on it. I'm going to put it on the water. Give it a couple of zips around. This is a uh, new pan Sharon got. I suppose it's uh, non-stick. What is it today, huh? If it isn't non-stick, you're not purchasing that pan. So I'm going over the pan because some of it already came off while it's sitting in the water. And I can feel a little bit of, of scrubbiness right here. So I'm scrubbing this in it. And there's one little spot right here that I can get. Yeah, right there. So I'm going to take it out and see what it looks like now. Spots. <laughs> Didn't work. Yeah, a couple of spots. Yeah, it kind of went around and I didn't cook it. So, yeah, I'm going to take this off with this scrubby. I'm not going to go down as much as I think I should to get this off. Yeah, I'm just going to take that off and leave it. Uh, not go down enough to uh, take a little finish off of the tray. Because I don't want to really do that. So, 64. Wow, five years ago, man. Yeah, five years ago I was 64. Holy shit. The Beezer guy is 69 this month. God damn it. I am one old fucking metalhead. Oh, Jesus, am I ever. Oh, I can't get enough to. Aaron's taking me. Aaron's taking me to two shows this year. Uh, Hate Breed at the Palladium, and usually have two other bands. And uh, Slayer and Lamb of God. <laughs> Let me finish this last bit of wine on this. I heard Slayer at the Palladium one year, and they were so loud, I couldn't, I couldn't listen to them, they were so loud, I had to put my hands over my ears. I split up my earbuds that day to some of the people that were with us that didn't like that kind of heavy, loud music. But when the Slayer came on, I needed a set of earbuds. <laughs> Man, unbelievably loud. Well, I'll be in an outside venue, so I don't care. Aaron bought us tickets for Hate Breed at the Palladium and Slayer and Lamb of God at uh, Great Woods. Oh. Side show means I can puff up all night long in Massachusetts. Massachusetts. 
I can puff up all night long. I can sit right there at the concert instead of going into the shitter and puffing up. I can sit right there on the grass because it is a uh, stadium. And you can sit right there on the grass and I can just puff it up, people. Done. Done, done, and done. Hope you guys got this night going here. Um, oh, that's still hot. That's still hot when that cools off. Because that went right in the oven. Oh, man. One of the better songs from these 80s. here for the new farmhouse look and I hang my apron on there. Wow. You guys are getting the whole nine yards tonight. I hope you're happy. Yeah, so what? <laughs> no metal TV. 